Hello everyone, my name is Amir and I am the instructor of ECE 330. I would like to welcome you to this course. I should have uh, prepared this audio earlier, but due to technical issues and you know uh, some other non-related uh, problems, I have been able to do that. So, my name is Amir Raisi Nafshi. I am originally from Iran. I moved to United States to pursue grad school here. I did my master's in Connecticut and I am now finishing up my PhD at University of New Mexico in the field of electrical engineering. Uh, in advance, I would like to tell you that uh, please, uh, uh, you know, or you know, in other sense, I apologize for my, you know, accent, English accent, and I hope it. I am saying the things clearly so you can understand. But if you do not, uh, or if you have problem with it, please bring it up. So I do my best to, uh, you know, to to be, a, to talk, uh, you know, as clear as possible. Um, so here is my email, and I told you, you know, I please use uh, this email for, you know, for communications. And if you log into UN to Zoom using UNM SSO, I will show you what I'm talking about. Let me just open my Zoom software. Um, so he, this is Zoom, right? So you want to you click on sign in, and then it has a variety of options for logging in. You should click here on sign in with SSO. And then here in this window, it's, there is nothing. You type unm.zoom.us and then you click continue. So here you see uh, that, you know, because I have been already logged in uh, through Um, to the uh, UNM, it just start uh, launch Zoom. Otherwise, it would uh, ask me to go, you know, use my UNM email and password to log in to UNM servers. So here, if you uh, if you log in like that, you are you will be able to find me with my Amir ORN at UNM.edu and add me as you know and then you know text me or you know call me if you want or you know set up meetings. This is one way. So this was just a quick uh, review of Zoom. I'm just gonna you know again uh, just you know I know that you have gone through this uh, syllabus before. I'm gonna just review syllabus really quick. So this course is three credit. This is my name. You just need to call me Amir. And there is no office location. This is my office where I sit, but you know, because of the pandemic, uh, we do not need to meet here. And uh, this is my email, you know that. Oh, this these things has to be updated. This is, should be a spring 2021. I, I still am not accustomed to 2021 for some reason. And uh, so I'm just going to fast forward to uh, some ideas that are probably will be important for you. So in the past, so this, in this course, we are going to cover three things. We will uh, talk about some basic concepts of, uh, you know, software design like the you know gang of four 
you know, the hierarchies, you know, some, I would say, theoretical stuff. And after that, we will be, uh, who, and then the other topic that we will be talking about is called uh, Unified, uh, you know, UML, Unified Modeling Language. And then uh, we will be uh, working with C++ and after that uh, Python. So these are some, I believe you do not need any specific uh, textbook to buy but you're you can you can uh, you can buy these ones uh, because there are tons of materials for free on you know google and then you can just search and use them so these are some course uh you know requirements that because you are in this class you're either you get waiver or you have that so we will not gonna uh, discuss them so the grading, this grading may change, may change, but so 10% of total grade depends on class activity and attendance. So we don't have an attendance here, but the class activity is your participation mainly in those discussions, group discussions that I create on learn. That, that, that the thing that I will consider as class activity. And, you know, there will be weekly, uh, you know, um, there will be six homeworks that, uh, you know, will you, you already seen like the first one and there will be uh, weekly homework prog programming assignments. Um, so all together, uh, there will be, they become 90%. And then, you know, I told you what uh, the class activity is uh, actually uh, the class activity and, you know, again, the class activity attendance is all together, which is uh, I will grade it through uh, discussions, your participation in discussion. So I have given you some... Uh, guidelines i will detail it further later uh, how to do that for those of you who are not familiar so i want you to upload your codes on um on github and then uh yeah, i'm explaining uh so everything should be uploaded on github and then you just on your learn for that assignment you just share the link that give me access to those materials on github so i don't want you to send me any code okay just the link to github and then for python that we'll, we'll have the next you know the second half of the semester will include python i want you to use jupyter notebook i will uh, i will i will walk you through i will create a separate video for that for those of you who are not familiar with jupyter notebook and uh, all I want is just, you know, this is the, you know, IPYNB. Uh, NB, you know, stands for uh, Notebook, you know, this is the extension of these codes that you create, Python codes. And then I want you to, again to uh, upload your uh, IPYNB codes to get GitHub account and then, you know, just uh, share a link with us so we can just uh you know with me i mean through learn so i will explain later again so the rest is you know some important information that i you need to read for sure and make yourself uh i would say you know you need to know them all of these these are the you know your rules department rules and then we have all of us have to follow them especially the time title line statement and uh, so that's it uh, that's it for uh, the review there's a uh, other thing that I uh, hope that you know you also had a chance to look at I tried I this is not complete yet but this is our 
uh, schedule for this semester so these are uh, i will i will also upload the lectures for uh python so technically you see in this course not only you learn the fundamentals of uh, software design not only you will learn how to work with uml unified modeling language you also uh, learn uh, object-oriented programming in both C++ and Python, which I believe will interest many of you. And uh, we c these are the advanced topics in programming, and I, uh, I'm happy that we are learning them in this class. So, and then, you know, whenever we have any quiz, uh, you will get an email announcement for that. So this is for the general uh, introduction to the course. And I will be back with uh, the, f the f materials for the lectures. Okay, uh, talk to you later.